Hello viewers, you're welcome to my vlog today. It's your girl Ify. Today I'm going to be talking about autism and change of weather. Does the change of weather affect autistic kids? The answer is yes. This is something I've been noticing for some years now, but I decided not to talk about it. I don't talk about what I'm not sure of, but this time around, I decide to share it with you because it's something I've been through and I know that it's 100% this is what it is. That's why I've come out to share it with you because there may be someone out there that is going through something that has not experienced this before and as an autistic child and by this time when the weather is changing and uh, the parents start seeing this and they are worried, oh, something else is wrong. Be calm. I want to tell you that it's something normal. It's something I've been experiencing and I'm like, okay, what is this? This year I decided to, why did I decide to follow it up and really know what is going on? On last two weeks Friday, my uh, the, the school where my son attended was like, he should not come to school again until he's calm. I was, okay, what really happened? They called on me to come and pick him up that is beyond control. And when I get to the school, when I got to the school, there were five teachers holding him and they couldn't. His own personal teacher that was assigned to him and other four teachers, I have to come to, you know, to calm down the situation. And I took, uh, before I took him home, I spoke with the teacher and she, she told me that it's, she's sure it's the weather change and okay when we got home and i've been noticing that also he has been so terrible and tantuming if you don't know what is tantum you have to watch my autism video to know what i talk when i say tantum okay so i when i came home i took him to the specialist hospital if you live in italy and in napoli you should know the hospital Santo Bono should ring a bell in your ear. So it's the most specialist hospital here in Napoli. It's the best so far. So we took him to Santo Bono. Santo Bono, the psychologist there, they did their thing. After some hours, they said it's the, due to the change of weather that he's going to go. It's just for this period. I shouldn't worry. So we did that. After we leave the hospital, I still went on going to the pediatric. And the pediatric said the same thing also and with the therapy center also it was so agitated i have to go with them to the therapy room and that day we were not able to do any therapy we just did like 10 minutes and it's supposed to last for one hour that day so we didn't do the therapy and the therapist also was it is the weather so i'm saying this you know, out of what I've seen, my experience from one year to six years now, I've had enough of it, so I know what I'm saying. So I hope I'm helping someone out there. It's nothing when your child is tantuming so much, if your child is autistic and tantuming so much in this period, it's nothing but, you know, you don't have to stay put and just say it's nothing. When you may think there is nothing, there may be something. So you have to do everything you can do. Pediatric, um, psychologist, neuropsychologist, this and that. Just make sure that everything is okay. I just want to convey this out to someone. I may be helping someone out there who knows that is what I have to say today. You know, change of weather affect autistic kids and make them to turn to a lot. So if you notice this, do not panic. It's just something normal. It will pass and everything will become normal again, as I was told. So this is what I have to say today. I hope I am able to help someone out there. So. Have a nice day and God bless you. See you on the next one. Ciao, ciao.